Hey everyone, how's it going? It's Cali Hiker, and today we're going to be reviewing the Chums Marsupial Wallet. Now, this is not the one that floats, and it's not the one that's waterproof. Uh, for that, I believe that's called uh, the Surf Sport or something like that. Um, that one is floatable, and I believe it's also waterproof. It has a couple more features than this one. This is basically the bottom of the line wallet that they offer. Um, usually, you can get them for about $7.99. I got this one at Bass Pro about nine months ago. Um, mainly got it due to the color and due to the simplicity I like going hiking and I like being outdoors and this color if I drop it I'm gonna be able to find it pretty easily uh, this is not the only color you can get it in you can also get it in colors such as gray black green blue even some feminine colors but um, obviously this is the one I chose like I mentioned because of its color now <clears throat> some features on this wallet uh, first of all it's just a dump pouch you can fit quite a few cards in it, but it's literally just a dump pouch inside with a nice little zipper. Like I said, doesn't has never failed me the zipper. And then on the outside, it's got a key ring, which I use to hold my spare change holder. Never had an issue with this breaking or anything. Durability seems to be pretty decent. Uh, for those of you wondering, it's made out of ripstop nylon, meaning that if a hole gets punctured in it, it's designed to stop the rip very quickly so that it doesn't spread and destroy the whole thing. Uh, dimensions for those of you wondering is four and a half inches by three inches tall um, some people have said especially on Amazon reviews that you cannot fit many cards in it from my experience I can fit quite a few we got seven gift cards right here they fit in very easily if I want to take one out like that put it back in of course you can also store cash in there um, until you hit about 15 cards is when it kind of hits its max but remember that the more the more cards you put in it the harder it's going to be able to get one out by itself. You got to really kind of fight it if you do too many. Now, that as far as my final review of this wallet, I have to say that I like it because I knew what I was getting when I bought it. It's just a simple little basically dump pouch that is a wallet. Um, if you want a wallet from them that's more sophisticated, I guess, they do offer a variety of different models of their wallets, this being the sim most simplistic. One negative, though, that I can say about it is that, like I mentioned before, I wish that it was easier to clean. Either I'm not cleaning it right, or I just, you know, it's just not really that easy to clean. You can see it's nowhere near as vibrant as it used to be when I first got it, um, which is, like I said, main reason why I bought it, so that I'd be able to find it if I dropped it in the woods. That's really the only negative I have for it so far. Uh, the stitching on the bottom, I, I haven't seen any fraying, I haven't seen any loose threads or anything like that. As far as durability goes, at least in this nine months that I've had it, I've had no issue with it. So basically, this wallet is basically a simplistic wallet, and if you've wanted one, I would strongly suggest getting one. I mean, only $7.99. If you don't like it, you can probably return it. It fits cards easily. It's going to be lightweight for those of us that like getting outdoors and don't feel like carrying around a heavy wallet. I mean, there's really nothing wrong with it. But anyway... I hope you guys enjoyed this review. I hope it helped you guys, you know, understand what this wallet has to offer. Um, so far, I don't, there's not a whole lot of reviews of this wallet that I've been able to find on YouTube. So I thought that it'd be a good idea to put one out, seeing that it's so cheap and it's so durable. Anyway, hope you guys have a good day and hope you guys enjoyed this review.